What's going on guys, it's your boy DPJ here today with another Destiny video and in today's video I'll be showing you guys this simple trick to get a higher light score. Now some of you will already know about this but many of you don't, hence the video. Now this requires strange coins and you can only really do it when Zer lands in the tower so basically from a Friday to a Sunday. Now for those of you who have armors at a light score of about 280 or 290, this won't really help. But for those of you who are struggling to get armors with light, this will boost you up. Now to explain, if you have a light score helmet of 250, you can head to Zer and buy a helmet. It doesn't matter what class it's for either. So with your 13 strange coins, buy the helmet and infuse it into your current 250 light score helmet. This will boost it up quite a lot. If you have molts of light, you can buy an engram. This week Zer is selling a helmet engram. When decrypted with the Cryptarch, these have 290 defense instead of the 280 defense which the armors you buy from Zer have. You may want to consider also buying a few of these armors if you have the spare strange coins and maybe a few engrams too just for when you start to level up your second and third characters. Well yeah, like I said, you can infuse Titan armors into your hunter gear. But to explain again, if you are a hunter or a warlock, you can buy a Titan helmet or a pair of gauntlets and you can infuse them into your legendaries. And it doesn't matter what class you're on. Hunter shit can go into your warlock, warlock shit can go into your Titan, Titan shit can go into your hunter, it's as simple as that. And like I said, if you have second and third characters to level up, this will make things a lot easier and faster. Obviously, you want to wait until you have armor you are happy with before you start infusing, as it will lead to you wasting materials and marks. What I did was, because I've already got an exotic chest armor, which I'm actually wearing, which offers 290 plus light, buying a helmet from Zer or buying a helmet engram from Zer and hoping I get an exotic out of it will be pretty pointless as I won't be able to wear it at the same time as my chest armor. So using it and infusing it into my legendary helmet boosts up the defense on my legendary helmet, in turn giving me a higher light score. Obviously, if you get an amazing helmet, one that you haven't got, you don't want to waste that shit, you want to keep that bad boy. And that's what I did and as you probably saw in my video earlier I was actually recording to demonstrate this right here I bought one helmet from Zer, took it to the Cryptarch and got a helmet I wanted and kept so I went back to Zer, brought another exotic helmet and got the Knucklehead Radar which you see me infuse into my legendary helmet in this video and that's the point obviously you don't want to be wasting your new exotics ones that you want to keep but if you do have enough mods of light buy a couple of these exotic helmets decrypt them if they're helmets you're not going to use or you don't need at this current moment in time you can use them to infuse into your legendary gear to give it a higher light score but guys i hope this helps i hope you understand if you don't leave a comment down below in that comment section ask me a question and i'll try and answer it for you thanks for stopping by as always do drop a like i do appreciate the support subscribe for daily destiny and i'll catch you on the next one peace out until next time peace Get it.